This here is the biggest lemon tree I've grown from seed and kept. It's about two years old. I enjoy propagating plants and giving them away. And over the years, I propagated dozens of lemon and other citrus trees from seeds. I've learned a few things during that time, and I'm going to share with you what seems to work best. By the way, this method works with all citrus seeds. Remove the seeds from a lemon. Don't use any seeds that were cut or frail and thin seeds. Carefully peel the hard outer shell of the seeds. This will be easier to do if you let the seeds dry for about an hour after removal. If you damage the inner seeds while removing shells, don't use those seeds either. Take the seeds that you peeled without damaging and place them in a wet napkin as shown. Fold the napkin twice over the seeds and place it in a Ziploc bag. If you don't have a Ziploc bag around, any bag will do. Just make sure you remove all the excess air from the bag and make it somewhat airtight so that the napkin inside doesn't dry out. Write down the date and keep it by the bag or mark it on a calendar. Otherwise, it's really easy to forget how long it's been while waiting for the seeds to germinate. Place the bag somewhere at room temperature that doesn't get any direct light. After two weeks, we open the bag. We'll plant germinated seeds in soil. Two of the seeds germinated quite well. One of them even sprouted leaves. Get some cups ready with drainage holes in the bottom and fill them with dirt. Citrus aren't very picky about soil type. We poke a hole in the middle of each cup using something like a pen or a screwdriver. Carefully remove the germinated seeds from the napkin and plant them so that the root is underground and the seed itself is about half submerged and half above the soil. Add water, then gently push down around the seeds so that the soil completely covers the roots without any air pockets. Keep these cups somewhere bright and water them every 2-3 days. I water mine on Tuesdays, Thursdays and Saturdays. You can stick to this watering schedule for a few years until your sapling is much bigger. Citrus saplings grow roots quickly and they need to be repotted often for the first couple of years. You can repot every few months or you can check the bottom of your pot. If there's more than 8-10 centimeters or about 4 inches of roots coming out the bottom, go ahead and repot it into a larger pot. This also helps them grow faster. Every time I repot a sapling, they go through a growth spurt. A question that comes up often when it comes to growing citrus trees from seed is, will it bear fruit or does it need grafting? There's a complicated answer, but simply put, it's best to graft. Actually, most will bear fruit without grafting too, but one, it may take a few years longer for your tree to give fruit, and two, not all citrus seeds are true to type, meaning you may plant a tangerine seed but get a lime tree or some kind of wild citrus fruit that may or may not taste good. Grafting will help us get the kind of fruit we want and sooner. It's even possible to multi-graft citrus, meaning you can get multiple types of fruit from one tree. How cool is that? You can look into grafting once the trunk of your sapling is about as thick as a finger, which usually takes about two years. That's all. Thanks for watching. I hope you'll grow prolific and fragrant trees that will add some joy and beauty to your life. Good luck.